Good afternoon, my name is Kevin Hansen. I'm the Leica Infinity product manager. I'm here today, I'm gonna to give you a short overview of the product itself, give you uh, some of the key points. So, one of the, the main aspects of the product is uh, combining data. We wanna be the bridge between the field and the office. This is to facilitate design, BIM, we have uh, all our sensors. We want to make sure that users can get that data both from the office to the field. That's one of the key parts. Then afterwards, you want to download that data, bring it back into the office, visualize it, analyze it, put it together, aggregate it, and then we want to bring it back to the, to the end, end deliverables. And this is one of the key points at Infinity from the standpoint of the product, traceability. And that's where I'll start. Uh, when you import a file, you see it always from the source. You know which date, which uh, file format, and you know when you did that. That's always key. Then you visualize it in the software, you bring it all together, you have what's called uh, the library, which is actually explaining to you all the, the objects you can work with. Uh, points, lines, areas, you got the surfaces, scans. And once you've worked with the data, you can export that, either uh, generate in a report or you're going to export to the uh, design software. And again, because of traceability, you can see this information. Here, very simple, we have a scan job, we have some GNSS data, you know, lines and areas, we have background images. Uh, and here you're also seeing another aspect of the software is consolidating and combining services. Uh, as an example, we have the hexagon imagery program. It's a background. We can capture that. We can send it to the field for field work. So here I have it off. I'm going to turn it back on. We have our scan data. Again, very collected, aggregated. Working with the software, you can turn things off or on as you need. To allow you to focus on specific data. Another aspect of Infinity is really our, our core competence of the sensor support. If you have a problem with a sensor, you want to be able to drive into it, find the problem, fix the problem. So again, part of the, the application itself is to, be, to make this easy to work with, to navigate through. Another aspect of the software, working with the different sensors, we have workflows. Uh, so not only can you import the data, you export the data, you have this traceability, we also have various functionalities included in the software to fulfill workflows. Surface determination, this is an option where a customer pays. If they need to work with surface data, they need to, to drive or derive a, a 3D surface. We're utilizing the TechnoDigit 3D Reshaper engine. You generate the surface, you can calculate volumes, uh, differences between volumes or differences between surfaces. Uh, generate contours, standard survey workflows. Uh, imaging here, this is also a, a factor of what we want to support from the field. A customer might have a, an imaging total station, and it's important to capture data, including imagery, and take this into the field where afterwards you can pull points from the images if you've uh, overlooked something in the, off, in the field. Of course, classically, we have the 3D adjustments module, and we support the processing of TPS data, digital level data, and GNSS with uh, the full spectrum of constellations, GPS, Galileo, GLONASS, Baidu, QZSS. What I want to focus on right at the moment is the actual most important aspect of uh, the product. To be able to bring data in, visualize it, prepare for the field, and then have the field sensors working with this data. And here we have an example of a BIM IFC file. Very nice house. And this is a very common workflow where a customer's got a new house they want to put to build. And what, what a user wants to do with Infinity is bring that data inside, visualize it, and extract the points which are core to the construction process. With our BIM Explorer, this is a very simple tool to allow navigating through the file. And you see here, I can also select the various objects I need to work with. This is what I want to send to the field. And once I've done that, then I can very easily, as you see here, I've got a few control points I want to just send to the field. I want to actually use like Exchange 
to wirelessly send that over the internet to the field sensors. So there's no data exchange with PC cards or USB stick. And in the end, this is what uh, the bridge between the field and the office is meant to show. Uh, bringing in complex data inside uh, the project, preparing the data, and sending it to the field. Thank you.